Hey everybody, it's Brian here. I know everything's kind of dusty and not all that great looking, but uh, I've been going through a lot in my life right now. It's been real, real busy. But uh, I wanted to show you guys this. One of the first things I found time to do. And I used Gordon's uh, sharpening technique from uh, the IBYMA contest some months back with a uh, little WD-40 and a uh, four-side stone that I got from my dad. It's actually like a... I'll have to show you in another video. I'm pretty sure I've you guys have seen it. Um, but I pretty much just used a little WD-40 and that block with it around. It's from 200 to 600 grit. Like, uh, it has four sides and one's 200, one's 300, one's 400, one's 600. Um, but anyway... Um, using Gordon's sharpening technique, I actually put a really pretty edge on this. Thanks to the geometry of the blade, like the profile, it has that little pattern on it. Like, you can see where the stone didn't touch when I was grinding on this. But I personally think it looks really cool. Like, just the way the light runs over it. You know what I'm saying? And not only that, but also when it comes to the blade profile, sure, it looks just like a regular flat grind pocket knife. Well, yeah, think about it. If this part right here wasn't touching the stone when I was grinding it, imagine how something I'm cutting will grip around it. Just a thought. But, uh... I am actually seeking everyone's approval on my work here. I know I flubbed up a little bit here, but that's to be expected. This is my first time actually, like, I've always used, like, a back-forth motion, like, forcibly. I've always flat ground, but this right here is sort of a, like, it looks flat ground, but I swear to you it's a convex grind. Uh, but I am actually seeking your approval on how it brings the grain out, and how it looks. Um, this thing will actually cut bottles. Like, it won't make complete, like, you know, cleave them in twain, but it's enough to be a practical carry knife that looks good, feels good, it's really light. Um, but aside from that, um, I'd like to talk to you guys for a minute while we look at my floor, because, you know, this is actually, like, the cleanest part of my room right now. Uh, ow! Uh, yeah, I hit my funny bone on my chair. Anyway, uh, what we're going to do is uh, I wanted to tell everybody uh, I'm still alive, I swear, and uh, there will be a lot more videos uh, coming up soon because I have a lot more time, a lot more money, and quite frankly, a lot more patience to spread around. So, uh, I will talk to you guys again soon. Later.